In this video, I want to find, go over find the first non-consecutive number on Code Wars. And what it states is your task is to find the first elements of an array that is not consecutive. By not consecutive, we mean not exactly one larger than the previous element of the array. So if we look at it, the example that they give us, the array that they'll provide us as input in this example is 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 8. 6 will be non-consecutive because 1 is... 2, 3, 4 is consecutive, meaning every element is one more than the one behind it. However, 6 is two more than the one behind it, so it's not consecutive. If the whole array is consecutive, then return null by the whole array consecutive. They mean something like this, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 will return, I guess, none since we're using Python. Now, the way I went about solving this is I first iterated throughout every element in this array, and I want up to n minus 1, and I'll explain why in a second, but for i in range from 0 to the length of array minus 1. And the reason I did this is because for every element in our array, let's take this example right here. So say the first iteration is 1. I am going to be checking the 1 right in front of it. Once we get to the n minus 1, I'm going to be checking the 1 right in front of it. If I iterated throughout the, say this was just length of array, like so. Once I got to 8 and tried to check the one in front of it, I'd go out of bounds and throw an error. So that's why I have to do that. So we're going to be checking to see if the current element is equal to the element in front of it minus 1. Basically say, checking to see if it's consecutive. So if r of i is equal to r of i plus 1, so the one right in front of it, minus 1. Well, what we're going to do, that means it's consecutive, and we're going to continue on to the next iteration. So if the current element is equal to the element right in front of it, minus 1, so basically saying the current element, 1, is it equal to the one right in front of it, minus 1? Well, yes, because 2 minus 1 is 1, 1 is equal to 1. That is a consecutive element, and we'll continue. If that is not the case, that means that is a non-consecutive element, and we're going to return the non-consecutive element. So R of I plus 1. Now, if we've iterated throughout every element in our array and all of them were consecutive, meaning we didn't return the non-consecutive element, we have to return none. So return none. And let's attempt this. So all 47 test cases passed. So that was the first, find the first non-consecutive number on Code Wars. I hope that this video was helpful and you learned something. If you did, I would appreciate it if you liked, commented, and subscribed. And I will see you guys in future tutorials.